Okay guys, this is our first video here. Just got the Photon S today. Wanted to go over, go over a little bit of the supplies that we're gonna use for the Photon. Um, this is from best methods that I've been seeing on everybody else's videos, so here we go. Here's some 91% isopropyl alcohol. Here is a strainer, which is way too small, so I ordered another one that's about three times as big. You can tell by the size of my hand next to it there. Um, here's some sprayway cleaner, uh, glass cleaner. Um, we have a 500 milliliter of the green anycubic resin, a solar uh, kind of spinner jobby, I'm not sure, solar display it's called. Um, just set it out in the sun and that's where I'll put our models to harden here, out in the sun. We have a large quantity here of about 30 of these blue strainers. All, most of this was purchased off Amazon. Right here we have some of these alcohol touchscreen wipes. They work really well for cleaning up resin messes since they're alcohol. Uh, what we also have here, I got a little respirator uh, from Home Depot. Um, we have a set right here of side cutters. Um, for a cleanup on the models, a nice little putty knife to pop off our models there, the build plate. Uh, we have an, a smaller X-Acto number one X-Acto knife and some blades and some disposable gloves for the dirty resin. We also have some microfiber towels here, but I was just shaking them. I'm not sure if you could see it and lots of fiber was falling off it. So I might go with a different towel here as to keep and of course, the best part of it all is our Anycubic Photon here, that S that just arrived today. So we're gonna be in unboxing it right now. Gonna have my son hold the camera here. Here you go. And uh, let's see what we have in the box. All right. Straight from China, I ordered this about 10 days ago or so, and uh, it just arrived today. It's supposed to arrive yesterday actually, but I got a note on the door saying I needed to sign for it. So luckily I was home today when FedEx showed up. Let's take this out and see what we have in the box here. Just use a regular razor knife to get it out, making sure not to cut down deep into the box so I don't ruin anything. I'm not sure how they packed this guy. go. Wonderful foam here. Gotta have that. All right. We have uh, the Photon S it's user manual, um, which you can see looks pretty detailed. I've heard this is a good manual and uh, you can find now I'm sure online. We have uh, some more media here. And it looks like, um, oh, some extra, um, some extra FEP film for the printer. That's nice. Um, we have a baby bottle of the green. So now I have 750 milliliters instead of 500. Starter bottle. Uh, power cord. Uh, it looks like their stamp of approval that it passed the quality controls. I'm going to pin this to the wall in case I find something bad. I'll send it back to them. Just kidding. Looks like some extra supplies, maybe a face mask here, a set of gloves, Allen wrench, um, the putty knife to pop a, the... We already have one, don't we? Yeah, we have the metal one, but this one is for uh, the actual, um, the bottom, when you're popping um, um, the res, taking the resin, I believe, off the bottom. You don't want to scratch up that plastic. Um, here's another power cord. Um, not sure what this one is. It might be that it adds the other side of this one, I think. Let's see what else we have here. A very box. special little, uh, it looks like an Allen wrench screwdriver. Um, their marvelous USB. Their marvelous USB, which I heard you, it's best to take the files off of and replace with a new one. Um, after sale service card. 
this is something I haven't seen yet on any of the videos, but uh, hopefully that's a credit card with a lot of money on it. Probably not. Okay. Let's take this guy out of the box now and see what we have in the actual box. Would you like this as a Christmas present? I would. They have this well contained here. At the top. Pull this guy out of the bottom here if I can get it out. Um, Want to be careful not to damage this taking it apart or you feel real stupid. And that happens and you have to wait another 15 days from China. Here we go. There's the printer straight out of the box. Here's the printer right here. So it's uh, well packaged. Doesn't look like we have any damage so far on it. Um, Carson, why don't you film this one? There you go. And let's take this out of the packaging now. This is my son and mine first time filming here and unboxing, so we are not professionals. We'll do the best job we can. All right, we're just going to take off the packaging right here on the... That is so satisfying. <laughs> okay. Beautiful little display on the front there. Really is quite a self-contained little unit here. All right, pop this open, no handle, so you just pull this up here, ooh, very strong, very strong, and uh, we'll pull this out here, looks like our build plate is right here. Here's the build plate, so don't throw the packaging away. We'll set that right here for now. Um, looks like we also have uh, some more uh, strainers for the resin here, which is nice. Yeah, and, we're having uh, like two of almost everything. Looks like we have a little bit of uh, wear on the side of the package here. Hopefully that'll wipe right off. And. Uh, so here we go, here's the printer. Um, that's the unboxing video. Um, we will uh, get another video going here shortly once we start getting this going. We should do like a and part we will, two on how to work it. We will do part two once we get our first, uh, uh, we start putting it together and we get uh, our first print going. So yeah. thanks guys. Make sure to check out my channel, CMA93908 Gaming Channel.